So just copy that question down. Um, Catherine, do you have your homework today? Um, hold on one second. Um, is this it? Um, this was due last week. This is not the homework. Do you really want to be this person? Let's be more organized, shall we? You got that jeans. Oh, but don't worry, it will go away soon. The first thing that I definitely would recommend to do is make piles for each of your subjects. This will be very easy for you later on when we come to making our own dividers. So just go ahead and do that. like this so now let's make our dividers so all you're gonna be needing is a piece of paper I just chose this really colorful one a stapler scissors a marker I just chose the sharpie one a three hole punch reinforcements and a scrap piece of paper I just chose this very colorful scrap looking piece of paper scrapbooking or pattern paper and all you want to do is cut it to a small size fold it in half and basically place it to wherever you want to place it um, you can definitely put it anywhere else not just the top um, and I just chose the top and just go ahead and staple it onto the paper once you got that take your marker of choice and write down your subject or whatever you're using divider for. I just wrote something down. I don't really know what it really means, but yeah. And, um, then you want to take your hole punch, punch your holes, and put on your reinforcements on all the holes of your paper. And you can definitely decorate your divider however you want. Add stickers, glitter, whatever you really want to decorate with. And there you have your dividers. Um, on the right section um, inside your dividers and your binder. And a quick tip is to have a folder with you inside your binder to keep extra uh, extra pieces of paper that may have no holes in them or you just don't know where to put inside your uh, divider. And don't forget to keep a lot of loose leaf paper because they will come pretty handy when it comes to writing your notes and such. And lastly, um, you can definitely decorate the cover to make your binder look prettier. Um, I just chose some really pretty um, scrapbooking paper and I put this um, sticker and I just wrote homework on it to know it's my homework binder and place it inside my um, sleeve that comes on my binder and that is pretty much it. I hope this video gave you guys
share some ideas and helped you guys to be more organized uh, for your binder. And I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And also subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.